morning, Beekman Elementary School. Welcome back. So great to have everybody with us. Hope you had some nice time at home and you were working hard on your uh, the schoolwork that you're doing at home. Uh, today is Thursday, October 22nd. It's also day one. Please stand and join me for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. For lunch today, we have chicken patty on a bun, corn, mixed fruit, fresh fruit, and milk. Mrs. Perone is out today, however, lunches and recesses will be covered. And students, you will be receiving a letter today with an entry form for the PTA Reflections Program. So uh, all students are invited to participate in the PTA Reflections Program this year. The theme for this year is I Matter Because. So if you watched the uh, video announcements yesterday, uh, you would have seen that I was talking a little bit about the PTA Reflections Program and the theme. And you do matter, and we're really interested in seeing your perspective and your thoughts and all of your ideas to show us how you know that you matter. So there's a lot of different ways you can participate in this program. You can write, you can draw, you can paint, um, you can video um, a song or a dance or even just a poem. So there's lots of different ways to participate in PTA Reflections. In the letter, um, you'll see that there's some information um, that you can use to help you with your project. An email was also sent a few days ago to all families, and in that email, there are links to a slideshow that was put together, and in that slideshow, there are links to videos. So they're short videos, about a minute or two minutes, uh, that can help explain what the PTA Reflections program is about, and it gives you some advice on how to do your project. Those videos have been posted on our website as well, so if you're home and your family wants to see the short videos about the PTA Reflections program, you can go on our website and check those out too. So I want to thank the PTA and our teachers for uh, putting this all together. Um, just a reminder that next Wednesday, so in six days, next Wednesday on the 28th, that's going to be PTA Reflections Day. So you're going to have the entire day to work on your PTA Reflections project. Um, teachers will not be assigning much work at all, so you'll be able to use the entire day to get creative, collaborate with friends, work with your family, do whatever you want to try to put a project together. Um, but you still have more time than that. You don't just need one day. You have until just before Thanksgiving to submit your PTA Reflections project. So the entry form um, explains some of that. If you have any questions, please talk to your teachers or you can come talk to me um, and we'd be more than happy to help you. So good luck, Beekman, with your PTA Reflections project. Oh, and I announced yesterday on the video announcements, I'm going to do one too. So I'm going to write a poem. I was inspired by a, a poet, uh, Chris Harris. He was... Uh, in Mrs. Armstrong's remote only class the other day, Mrs. Armstrong's class, they invited him for an author visit and I was invited too, so I got to check him out. He was really cool, really nice, really great uh, writer and I was inspired by some of the poetry he wrote and read. So I'm gonna write a poem about why you matter to me and I'm gonna read that poem next Wednesday on the morning announcements. We have two birthdays to announce. Happy birthday to Jackson Staropoli. Jackson, we hope you have a wonderful birthday today. And Abigail Sevchek, happy birthday to you, Abigail. Hope you have a super day today. And for today's thought of the day, it's when you know better, you do better. And that is true. We all do the best we can at the time. And then when we get new information or more experience, now we can do better. So just remember, we're all doing the best we can each day. And then when we know better, we can do better. And we can do better the next day. So keep working hard, Beekman. We're very proud of you. Glad to have you back. Have a super day.